Here's a setup I have for my mold. And some poly here. Gorilla tape goes all the way around the edges. And then silicone to make a seal. And I just have to grind a little bit off of these bolts to make them fit a little better in there. My coils will be connected to those and then this has the holes in it. I'll slide over the bolts. They're sandwiching the coils down. And uh, this will go over it, pushing down on that. I can screw this down. I can't screw this to anything. I don't want to take a chance of screwing in there. And anyways, it'll have resin around the screws, so I don't want that. So we'll try that, see how that works out. So I've got all these coils laid out here now. And now I'm in the process of oming them out. If anybody wants to know what they ohm out at, point four. And if anybody ever needs a wicked way of connecting wires together, this is the best way to go that I've found so far. Find these on eBay, probably Amazon too, I imagine. It's a little chunk of solder right here. When they heat up, they shrink. This little red spot seals it, makes it air and water tight. So, yeah, and they're cheap, easy to get, easy to use. Just a heat gun or a lighter, that's all you need. Yeah, that's what we got here so far. Time consuming part. I'll be back. So I've got it all wired here. Actually almost fucking wired it as a five phase. I had it even labeled it. I didn't even notice when I was labeling it. Burn out. But I realized before I started to wire it that it was wrong. That's what it ohms out at 1.8. Each phase is all the same. And I was going to use these big brass bolts here to connect them together. But it's just, they're too big for what I cut out here. So I'm not going to use these anymore. So I have these stainless steel ones. They're non-magnetic. I think I'll use these. That should work out just fine. Put those in there. Three of each. Three there, three here. Hook it to the switch that is able to switch this from delta to star just in one quick switch over. There'll be just three wires coming out of that switch. And yeah, these connectors work great. Very fast and easy. Cheap. No issues. You know, as long as you give them their time to harden, they work great. And here it is now with those bolts installed. Ready for resin.